Hello and welcome. In today's video, I uh, will be going through a small step, step by step, on how to convert your your coins uh, into USDT from, let's say, BNB from any other form of coin in Binance into uh, USDT or USDC or any other stable coin. As you can see, the week has been great. We have made to made some profits. On Solana, we have made uh, almost 66.8% in BNB, 13 in Binance, uh, in Bitcoin, 22.27 and Ethereum, 21.2. It has been a, a great week. There has been a pump in the market. Binance uh, uh, in Bitcoin, 22.27, and Ethereum, 21.2. It has been a, a great week. There has been a pump in the market, but I have a feeling that the pump is coming in, coming to an end. As you can see that BNB has today dropped by 2.4. Uh, Bitcoin has dropped by 0 0.1. Ethereum has, no, Ethereum has increased, but I feel I have a feeling that the the market is going uh, is going bear again after a consolidation. As you can see, as you can see from this edge, there is a consolidation here. I have a feeling that uh, the market is going bear again. Uh, the, the Bitcoin market is, is yet to be become bullish as you can see we are still still waiting for that to happen so don't lash it's time to accumulate more of bitcoin than jumping by the wave this was just a small pump i have a feeling that it's coming to an end so for that from that we just jump to a binance uh, exchange and we go direct to the portrait here. That's my profile. You click on profile, you go direct to wallet and go to spot and uh, fiat and spot wallet. Then you click, you let it open. As, as it opens, you can now pull down until where you get to a uh, our coins, we had Solana and we have Ethereum that have gained something here. So I want to convert them into USDT as the stable coin. Meanwhile, to, to be on a, on, a, on a safer side as the market turns uh, bear again. So to end, you go direct to the ad and convert, you want to convert this one, you click convert, then, then on this, you, we want to convert our Solana into, you change this to USDT, that is the stable coin that I'm using, Calentre, then you can pick maximum, I want to convert the whole of it, to USDTs, then you preview, you preview, then you, as you can see, our USD, our Solana will be converted to 4.1 USDT, which is not a, not bad. Then uh, we can refresh, we can refresh. No fees at this conversion. Then we go to convert. As you can see. The conversion is successful. Now we have you have received 4.1 USDTs at and the rest you can see. Then we can go back and do the same to our our Ethereum. We go we go down. Sorry. Go to the profile wallet, 
fiat and sports. Then you go to you scroll scroll it down and you pull this we want to convert our ethereum 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 this one 406 you click convert then another window pops in then we have our ethereum we want to convert it to be to usdts that's the stable coin i'm using then you tick maximum then you preview and there our ethereum will have been converted to 3.2 then you convert sorry the system failed so you can you can restart again you preview and then you convert and there we are successfully we have received our 3.25 USDTs. And now you can go to the spot wallet and you will be able to see your, your USDTs added to the, to the balance. And there we are. As you can see, we have a balance of 16.89 and we can hold it as, as, as at now. But as the market start uh, dropping, we will start accumulating more Bitcoin or other coins, depending on maybe using the, the, the dollar cost averaging, which will help us to accumulate more as we wait for the bear market to arrive, which we are suspecting and get guessing that by 2020, the start of 2020, the dead of 2020, 2024, and the start of 2025, we will start experiencing the, the, the bear market for Bitcoin. Before we end this video, I would like to request you to kindly subscribe like the video subscribe to this channel and don't forget to hit that notification bell so that to be informed whenever we post a new video